So, some users noticed that their shiny new GeForce RTX 5080A Aorus Master, which costs over $1,600, had a bit too much thermal gel. One user in South Korea even reported that it looked like the gel was spilling out when the card was installed vertically. Naturally, this raised alarms. Could it mean overheating or damage? Well, Gigabyte has responded. They've tested these cards in every possible position, including vertical setups. So, if you're worried about your rig, relax, they say it's all good. Gigabyte admitted that some early batches did have too much thermal gel, but here's the kicker, they're calling it a cosmetic variance. Yep, it looks messy but won't affect performance. Now the gel they use is tough stuff, it doesn't melt unless the card hits 150 degrees Celsius, a temperature it should never reach under normal use. So, no melting worries here. They claim it's safe and won't damage your precious GPU. They also mentioned that newer cards have the right amount of gel now, still not everyone's convinced. One user reported the extra gel came dangerously close to the PCIe slot. If gel gets in there it could be a nightmare to clean and might cause serious issues. Despite this, Gigabyte hasn't issued any recalls or specific warnings. In their full statement, Gigabyte emphasized that the gel is applied by machines to ensure even spread. Plus all cards undergo rigorous tests, heavy workloads, high temps, different positions, you name it. They're working to keep everything safe and top quality. So, while the extra thermal gel might look odd, Gigabyte says it won't harm your GPU. Let's hope they're more cautious and clear in the future. Thanks for tuning in. For more GPU updates, hit that subscribe button. Catch you in the next video.